Paul Scholes found himself in the firing line this week after Man UTD fans revisited an unsavory incident involving Arsenal's Jose Antonio Reyes. The throwback video, taken during the FA Cup semi-final at Villa Park in 2004, shows the England midfielder scythe down at 20-year-old Reyes with a horror tackle. Launching himself at the Spaniard from behind, Scholes snaps through Reyes bending his trailing leg at a horrific angle to leave him prone on the ground. Mystifyingly, the challenge was deemed worthy of only a yellow card by referee Graham Barber. Y-O-U-T-U-B-E-G-E-T-T-Y Paul Scholes was slammed for this horror tackle on Spanish forward Jose Antonio Reyes in 2004. It left substitute Reyes with minor medial ligament damage, keeping him out of action for around three weeks. But after a clip of the tackle resurfaced on social media site Reddit this week, United fans agreed it could have been a career render, that's an outrageous tackle. Nothing to be proud of in my opinion, one supporter wrote. Another said personally I never really liked this part of his game, he clearly did this on purpose and could have broken Reyes' leg. Getty the United legend retired in 2013 and now works as a pundit for BT Sports which Premier League player made the most passes during the opening weekend of action Getty 19. Antonia Rudiger 72 There's physical play and then there's dangerous and excessive play. Disguising dangerous tackles as innocent mistakes is a bit dishonorable. Paul Scholes wasn't still as my all-time favorite player but the one downside to a model player was his habit of nasty tackles, a third added. Scholes retired in 2013 having spent his entire career at Old Trafford, being hailed as one of the finest midfielders of his generation in world football. He currently works as a pundit for BT Sports. Related articles